talking of the fashion savvy Indian women and the kind of new ideas that one could seep into the fashion world, looks like most international fashion institutes and houses, even those like YSL and Gucci, are turning to India for the real talent. In the world of fusion fashion, they find that Indian talent and, of course, Indian expertise in textile would then help them try and tap the large talent pool out of the country. India, the back office to the world, is now a cliche. But for Indian brains to drive top end fashion brands is the latest move as names like Gucci, Gas, La Perla, and others set their eyes on India. Indian fashion graduates could soon play a major role in tailoring, designing, and managing their products as more than 7 to 8 international fashion institutes get ready to set up schools to grab the highly skilled manpower. Modart, a leading French institute, recently set up its first institute in Mumbai and is expected to extend itself to Delhi, Bangalore and Hyderabad going forward. Italian Institute, IFM and Canadian fashion school, Seneca are looking at Indian partners. And other leading institutes from the US, UK, Canada and Italy have their executives scouting for opportunities. To be in India was a must. A must because India has been for many, many, not years, but even centuries. Uh, well known for the excellence of uh, its creativity, its arts in general, and I think that it is uh, a necessary match. Experts believe the designers churned out of Indian institutes are very good at designing, but they have very limited skill sets on the management side of fashion, and that is where international training institutes can come in handy. We have the international institutes that will be coming to the country. It would be nice in a way because it would be bringing a different viewpoint. If we are adding the other subjects of the marketing and the fashion merchandising and all that, it's going to add more value to, to the courses that are imparted. Indian fashion industry is growing at an average rate of 25 to 30 percent and it is likely to grow eight times by 2011 to 2012 to 2,000 crore rupees. India has some of Asian fashion. Mumbai and Delhi are top on the lines of fashion capitals of the world like Milan, Paris and New York. Experts believe they is not far away when there will be an Indian hand in every thought of photo art designed by the leading labels of the world. In Mumbai, Kitan Thakkar for NDTV.